Prepare for Ruffin! Prepare for Ruffin! Ruffin fire! Ruffin fire! Ruffin fire! Ruffin fire! Ruffin fire! Ruffin How many enemy what times? One two Alpha, one two Foxtrot. We've got two times enemy on the home side of the bridge on one two India's side. Over. So as part of our training here as the EP Battle Group, you know, one of the things that we absolutely have to be is combat credible. Uh, and combat credibility for me is, is a function of three things. Uh, one is our integration, and that's not just only our integration across the whole region, uh, but also our integration into the Estonian National Defence Plan. It's also about interoperability uh, and our ability to interoperate with our Estonian partners. But it's also, and as you've just alluded to, it's also about uh, our ability to soldier in this environment alongside our Estonian uh, colleagues. 
and the cold weather operators course is really the vehicle that gets us ready um, to be combat credible in these kind of conditions. You know, as British soldiers, we don't often soldier in sort of minus 20 degrees Celsius or this kind of depth of snow. It presents equipment challenges, clothing challenges, as well as different tactics. And the cold weather operators course uh, provides that foundational baseline bit of training uh, to make sure that we can build upon that and be as, as, good, as, as good a team as we can be. This week, what we have here, we have the Estonian company commanders who had the opportunity to lead the British tank troops under their command in order to conduct offensive operations. So obviously this is only for the training purposes. We are not expecting to have those tanks all the time for us, but it gives our commanders a very good opportunity to understand how the tanks work and how to use them in their benefits. I think we're very lucky this winter. We actually have lots of snow. We have minus temperatures up to minus 20 so it really challenges not only i think for the efp battle group for ourselves as well they are very harsh conditions for the soldiers to work in in uh, to conduct military operations but i see that the efp battle group is very well trained for that i do know that they have been a they have had some specific training for cold weather operations when they are here and it's good to see that they are adopting with those slippery roads with those snowy conditions and the harsh cold as well.